All right, so um, we'll just mention the number that yeah. you can text, okay? The number you can text uh, is uh, 0947 seven something. <laughs> I, you know, I keep forgetting. Yeah, 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 there, 796-9361 right there. Okay, if you have any questions. Yeah. Um, of course, we, we might not be able to answer all the questions like the last time Marami Ring the text. And uh, we, we apologize for that. But we'll try as much as we can to answer all those questions. And we'll post them on our Facebook page. Yeah, we do. Mm -hmm. We always do. Yeah. Well, Facebook.com slash SME Forum. Yes, Facebook.com slash SME Forum. And, okay, so we'll go back. We'll, we'll, start, with, uh, we'll start with Mark's uh, yeah, question thanks. here. The question that I was asking and I'm really curious about is yeah. how ready, by the way, you can, you can also answer <laughs> for both of you. Okay, how ready is the Philippines mm. compared to other Asian nations uh, when it comes to cross-border trade? Actually, me and Jody were talking about it uh, before we came on air, and uh, Jody was saying, uh, I and I agree, there's a increase in uh, uh, mm -hmm. usage online or business online, and I totally agree. Uh, personally, I have also some membership sites, yeah, and oh. I noticed that a lot of people, I, as I said, uh, around a month ago, mm -hmm. they would pay via bank or you know, <coughs> go to my office and pay. Right now, since two months, I've been receiving a lot of PayPal payments. Ah, okay. And so that's one sign that I look at, wow. So people are more used to paying online. Uh. Whereas before, um, I believe that people are still, were still a little hesitant on yeah, putting their yeah. credit card information online and stuff. But because of so many safeguards now, I think more and more people in the Philippines are maturing. So that's one sign I'm looking at. Another thing I, I want to say mm -hmm. is that the Philippines, compared to other nations, we are a lot more conversant when it comes to English, mm -hmm. customer oh. service. I mean, we're known for that. Yeah. We're very, very uh, friendly. We're very, very customer-oriented compared to... I'm not knocking down any con countries, but mm -hmm. because I've been traveling also, I've noticed that yeah. you go to another country that's not Philippines, they treat you different in a hotel. And oh, unless yeah. the person in the hotel is a Filipino. Oh. <laughs> and, and, and it's the, also the English-speaking skills. It, that's what. They're conversant uh -huh. in English, very um, literate in, in English-speaking. They can understand. Mm -hmm. And most of the, 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 the Western world, mm -hmm. where cross-border resides, is, you know, English-speaking. So, so yeah. uh, how ripe do you think we are? Uh, how ripe is this market for the taking? <laughs> very, very, very ripe. Um, I've seen an upsurge of a lot of local clients. Mm -hmm. yes. uh, and these are clients not starting from scratch. You have companies that already have websites. Yes. Uh -huh. But they're saying, how can we now sell? Yeah. How can we make our website turn into a selling machine? Mm -hmm. You would see that they have a complete set of uh, okay. information on their websites, but now they want to sell uh -huh. uh, their, their pro via their website. They want to make uh -huh. it into an e-commerce machine. Okay, I think that that's the, that's the cue to jump into this. <laughs> yes. Okay, Karen, could you put up the uh, the the slide for us, uh, Georgie's slide, the the one. The one about the capture page. What is that? Yeah. Well, it is this one of the oh, a sales wow, okay. page, and and I I'm, I just made a quick one uh, image here. Mm -hmm. It just tells you that you probably just need ten items. Mm -hmm. It's showing nine, but ten items to make sure that you're going to increase your 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 sales page, mm -hmm. and you don't have to be. Uh, a web development guy. You, you, you're you're yeah. first and foremost, you're a sales guy, you're a marketing guy. First, you make sure, number one, you have a very nice looking headline yeah. and, and a secondary headline. Number three, you must have an in, impeccable sales copy. Mm -hmm. And number four is a social acceptance. Oh. You must have testimonials because, mm -hmm. you know, it encourages people to, to uh, to trust you, to trust you because I am they're, they're changing artisan. my web yeah. right. <laughs> website page and, right now. And uh, num uh, it didn't show there, but number five says that there has to be a call to action. Okay, it's there, but actually, mm -hmm. visitors are saying, "What will I do?" And you say, "Click now." Huh. That, that's number one. And uh, what's also very important sometimes is could we put up the slide again, please? Just, just sure, sure. Yeah, <laughs> right. and um, and uh, another one. Is, are just not just a product there. image, but if you see number eight, mm -hmm. it could be 
a hero image, a, hero. a person, a uh -huh. person smiling, yeah. an, uh, an old lady, if your your target market is there, a mm -hmm. businessman, a hero image is very, very important. Wow, okay. And uh, number nine, number as nine. you can see, is yeah, it right. has to be above the fold. That means they don't have to press page down uh, just to get information. Down, yeah. You have uh -huh. to put your design, uh, all the information on page one. So it has to be above the, the fold, that's what we call them. Okay. And lastly, number Ooh, 10 yeah, uh -huh. is test. Because uh -huh. the only person who's going to tell you if your, your, your website is good are your customers. So you have to keep on changing some of these elements until your sales conversion goes up. Okay, all right. And you don't need to, you don't need uh, to be to learn HTML, yes. it's just all marketing a here. Actually, you can yes. you can use a, a website I use, Weebly. Mm. Yeah. Weebly.com yes, Weebly is, is yes, free. Weebly is you can fine. actually do that. That's on right. Weebly. That's right. You can you can change all those okay. elements, and mm -hmm. and you don't have, need a web developer. We we have a question. Yes. Oh uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. How much? What kind of do you buy as uh, training? Yeah, your upcoming training. Uh, yeah, that's cross border. That's cross-border training with PayPal. With yeah. PayPal. Uh, and, it's, uh, and it's on May 26. Yeah, Magkano yeah. daw yun? Uh, there's a site. <laughs> yeah, I don't, uh, I don't want to uh, you know, ruin the price <laughs> because I might say something wrong. So <laughs> <laughs> there's a higher price, right? No, no it's, uh, yeah, it's, I, I, yeah, it's $120. Yeah. 120 but if you have already a website, Mm -hmm. And you're, 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 you have products there. You'll be given, I think, a subsidy of $50. Yep. Oh, yes. wow. So it's 120 less. Yeah, we're encouraging even those who have products already uh -huh. uh, that are being sold from their website. We're encouraging them to join because uh -huh. uh, 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 one of the objectives here is to increase... Uh, their sales by two thousand five hundred dollars a month. That's I, the, that's the. I think there's oh, a well, Facebook sure. page for that, right? It's there's an a it's it's facebook.com yeah. slash ecommerce one o two. Yes, yes, yes. yes. You and can get a lot of information from that. Yes. yes, go there because you'll get more information. Because I also think, no, I I know mm -hmm. that the dollar. Mm -hmm. Because it's dollars, no, and you're mm -hmm. going to be in paying peso. You're going to get an extra discount because a dollar is pegged at 42. Ah, okay. okay. Oh, so it's a discount if you pay in dollars. Even discounted, pa. Ah, okay. No, it's discounted if you pay in peso. Uh huh. But if you want to get, uh, you pay in dollars. That's okay because at 42, uh -huh. you're getting a discount of about 20, 50 cents, uh -huh. right? Because the exchange right now is 42, 50. Ah, so okay. it's pegged, pegged at 42, and I, I would suggest that you go and sign up now. Yeah. For May 26. It's it's just around the corner already. Yeah, yeah. And if if you're really getting into this, this is serious stuff already. Yeah. And uh, this is the nitty gritty of of actually getting into business online. Right. Yes. Okay. Right. So yeah, get get into that. That's Perfect. Okay. Yeah. So so how do you? Uh, I mean, how does how does uh, uh, what is the role? I mean, PayPal. How do you guys use PayPal? That's what I wanted to ask. <laughs> okay, Georgie, you, Georgie, how do you about? use PayPal for, for this? I mean, just just uh, coming in. How do you um, use PayPal? Well, for for my previous business and I, until I sold it, we were looking. We were having, I, I think, uh, for our individual customers, we were hitting around twenty five to forty percent of our sales coming from PayPal. Twenty five percent. That's that's bigger. Huh? Yes, yes. Uh -huh. That's significant. So it's something. It's one payment method. You shouldn't. You uh, you shouldn't. Uh, uh, go without, you know. You, you should shouldn't ignore it. So you should you should include it, and um, it's uh, and for our smaller businesses, it's a very good opportunity to take in credit mm -hmm. card payments. Yes. So, and I, I, even with Mark, yep. uh, he's uh, he's getting a lot of uh, payments.